Jessica with Fantabulosity.com and I have my next trunk club unboxing video for you right now. Uh, I've already had one in January, but I was really quick to return that one, so I went ahead and hurried up and scheduled the next one. So I'm getting two in January. Is that bad? <laughs> Maybe. So I don't know what we shall call this one. Maybe we'll just call it trunk club uh, January number two. Does that sound good? I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so, but the last one, I kept, I, I kept a lot last time. Why do I have such a hard time getting in these boxes? Oh, for Pete's sake. And then when I finally get it open, it's like, oh, like that. Oh, there we go. Sorry. Um, I kept a lot from the last one. Like, two pairs of jeans, a vest... Um, a striped shirt. It was awesome. It was so good. And I'm hoping this one is just as good. I kind of hope it's not. So I don't feel tempted to keep everything again. I wanted to keep everything last time, but I just couldn't. I could not spend that much money keeping everything. So I had to say no to some stuff and put it on like my wish list for later. Um, oh crap. <sighs> okay, this is gonna be good. So if you missed my if you don't follow me on Facebook, um, you may want to head over there now if you're watching this on YouTube or just on the blog randomly if you came over from Pinterest or wherever. Um, you may want to follow me on there. So just search for Fantabulosity blog and it should pull it up. What I do over there at times, there on Instagram, I'll show you the, um, the sneak peek or the preview that Trunk Club sends to me and I get some feedback on what I should tell them to keep and don't send me. Um, so I showed a sneak peek of what the one was the other day, and I told them to send one, but in a different color if they had it. And I think that was it. And I've had a lot of people ask me why the previews are just completely, well, they've had problems too. Like the previews are usually just like so out there and not their style at all. And I got to wondering, and I don't know, I've never talked to them about this, but I'm wondering if they show you the brand new stuff, uh, just to try to like, you know, get the brand new in style stuff that's out there, even though it, even though if it's not your style, I don't know, maybe, maybe if you guys know, you could tell me. Um, and then you have the opportunity to say, no, heck no. Oh yeah, send it, you know, and then when they actually send you the stuff, they'll, they send stuff that they think you may like. I don't know. Does anybody know? I'd love to hear if that's true. Hi, Jessica. I included a super cute bomber and some fun tops. <sighs> Love the lace hinge top. Keep me posted and enjoy, Paulina. I love Paulina. Okay, I want to say this too. I've had a lot of you sign up for Trunk Club since I've started doing these videos. And a lot of you, well, some of you have told me that when you've signed up using my referral link that you get Paulina, which is awesome because they, one, somebody said Trunk Club told them that they automatically get attached or um, assigned, not attached, attached to the same stylist that I have because they know that you must like what she's doing or something. So if you use my referral link, you may get Paulina if you like the style of clothes. So I appreciate it if you use my referral link. You don't have to, but that is a bonus if you do use it. Okay, return stuff. Okay, oh, I'm not looking at the prices. Okay. <gasps> oh wait, I saw this on the preview and I told her to go ahead and send it, I think. Because I'm thinking, how cute will this freaking look with white jeans and brown boots. Like my brown knee-high boots. If you haven't seen those, they're on probably one of my previous trunk clubs. Go to the blog and type in, in the search bar, uh, trunk club. And one of them should pop up. But I've been wearing those over-the-knee boots. They're so stinking cute. A lot. And I think this would look so cute. Um, it's short, a little boxy, so they make it look completely different on. But I'm loving the neckline on this. Like, I'm loving that. So this is the Madewell, and it's a small. Yeah, I freaking love that. Okay, so um, let's look here. The Madewell, um, $69.50. But, you know, if I love it and it looks beautiful on, I may have to keep that one. Okay, this is, what is this? What is this? Okay, so it's just a basic, like, long sleeve t-shirt. Um, the brand is Caslon. I know you all make fun of me the way I pronounce these things because I'm sure it's all wrong. Uh, so it's just a basic, like, cream white t-shirt. You know, one of those things, I think in my first trunk, um, I got sent a lot of basics, which is fine, but I didn't want to pay the price for the basics when I could get it at Walmart or Target. 
Um, so let's see, this is, what is this? $25. Okay, so, I mean, if I love it and it goes good with an outfit that she sent, then it's worth it, but still, I could probably get it cheaper somewhere else, right? It's a cream white, so that may be harder to find than just a plain white one. All right, now this, oh, I kind of like this. I, I must be getting into lace because I'm kind of digging lace lately. Um, hinge. This is so cute. I bet it's expensive. What do you want to bet? Because she specifically said she really likes it on the note. And I bet she's trying to get me to buy it. <laughs> um, so it's see-through. Maybe that's why, ah, maybe that's where this comes into play. Oh, that'd be so cute with jeans, like dark jeans and some heels for date night. Oh, oh, that'd be so cute. Oh, that'd be so cute. Okay, move on. Let's see. Hinge, hinge. Hinge. Okay, $69. Okay, I mean, that could definitely be worse. Not as much as I thought it was gonna be. Okay, um, a tuxedo jacket. I, I said tuxedo jacket because it says tuxedo. I like briefly saw that, $125. I think I have a black like blazer anyway. I mean, it, this sucker is thick, like it is heavy. Shoulder pads. <laughs> um. You know, it would be really cute with the right outfit. And I'm sure she sent me, like, a outfit suggestions, which they do. And I'm sure it looks super, super cute with, like, that lace shirt. But I'm not paying $125 for a jacket when I think I already have a black one. Maybe I don't. But I'm going to tell you that there is a website. And I haven't looked on it in a very long time. But I bought a bunch of blazers last spring from a website. And the you guys that have been following me for a long time now, you, you know, because I used to talk about it all the time. LE3NO.com, I think. And I used to buy so many blazers off there. So check that out if you need a blazer. And I'll probably check it out for a black one if I don't have one. Okay. Let's see what this is here. Um, oh, and that LE3NO website is so affordable. Like the jackets were like 18 bucks or 20 bucks or something. Oh man, this looks so cozy. Wait, what is this? It's like a sweater dress. It's really long. Okay, hold on here. Treasure Bond. So it's a gray Treasure Bond. Like, man, that looks comfy. Yeah, you know cozy that would be with some leggings. Guys, I haven't left my house in seven days. My son was supposed to have gymnastics tonight, and I was getting ready, like putting normal people clothes on instead of normal people, like everyday real clothes instead of yoga pants or leggings and a big t shirt. And I realized I haven't left my house since last Wednesday. Guys, today is Wednesday. I haven't left my house since last Wednesday. I am officially a hermit. Um, and oh, but then we didn't go to we didn't uh, go to gymnastics. So I'm still like tomorrow will be day eight that I haven't left, and I kind of don't want to leave. So this guy's guys not standing up. It goes all the way down past my knees. So I don't really know what this is, but it looks heavenly. Like it looks so comfy. I hope I'm not slipping into like moo moos or something. I don't even know what this is. Treasure Bond, charcoal, off the shoulder, fleece knit dress, $79. Okay, first of all, I'm loving that it's off the shoulder. But does it look like it? I guess I could do that. $79 for a sweater? I don't know. Uh, dress, I don't, I don't know. Um, but I kinda like it, it's really kinda cute. Um, I don't think I want to pay $79 for it though. And especially with a dress made like that, it really hugs my waistline and I am not flattering there at the moment. So, I don't know. Oh, what is this? Paulina, you are the bomb. You are so, I know I just said that. I shouldn't say that. That's so, I don't know, silly why I say that. Okay, this is so cute. This is so cute, okay. Oh my gosh, I kind of like this. Now it's really long, like, well I say really long, like it goes down past my hips. But I really like the deck, deck detail, the neck detail on that. Um, oh, wait, oh, 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 uh, 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 no. No, I don't think so. I thought it was sleeveless, but it's it's got sleeves. And it's got open shoulder. I don't think I'd like that. That's a little out of my comfort zone. But I don't know. We'll have to see when I try that on. I should do a try on video with this one though, guys. Okay, so this is the next one that I told her to go ahead and send. A lot of you in my preview on Facebook said, heck no, don't send. But I asked if she had this in cream because I think I would like it in cream. But 
I don't know. I know. I, I really, it was one of those things like, I wasn't in love with it. A lot of you were like, heck no. But there was something about it. I was just like, I kind of want to just see it on and see what it looks like. So, and she always told me, you know, just give it a try. You know, even if you don't think you like it, because you never know. So let me take a good look at this again. Oh, I didn't tell you the price of that pink thing. Ruffle Edge Cold Shoulder Blouse, $79. Okay. The Hinge Black Embroidery Mesh Top, $69. Okay. So, I don't know. I really want to see that on. Ooh, here's that bomber jacket I wanted. Yes, yes, yes. So, it's a Steve Madden bomber jacket. It's black. I don't have one. And I really have always wanted one. I kind of want a military green one, though, too. So, I don't know. Hi, sweet pea. Um... But I had a reader suggest that, or say that she doesn't like bomber jackets because it makes her look, what did she say, heavier or something about it. She didn't like because they were so short and puffy. Um, and I'm afraid I'm going to have that same problem too. So I'll try that on and see. And there's one more Ooh. thing. Yeah. Could you put my belt on? Yeah. Can you give me like two seconds yeah. or maybe two minutes? Yeah. All right. And there's a very last thing. Looks like shoes. Okay. Uh, what? Shoes. Yes. What is this? What are these? Dugan Flat Loafer Mule, $109. Oh, uh, they're like metallic. Ugh. Mm, so now I won't be keeping those. See, maybe I'm not in style, but... Oh, oh baby. No, we're going to eat supper here in just a minute, okay? Then we can have a cupcake. Mommy made cupcakes. Okay, so that was it, you all. I think it was still really good. Like, I should have opened those shoes first. And then I probably would have enjoyed everything else even better. <laughs> but no, I really liked a lot of it. Like, hey, excuse me. I'm almost done. But I really think I like the majority of it. And um, I don't know. We'll see. I'll try to do a try-on video. I'll try to do a try-on video here in a couple days and see if I can get that up so you guys can see what it looks like on. Hey, excuse me. Okay, guys. So that was it. Head over to the blog at fantabulosity.com. If you want to see the previous trunk clubs that I've done and the pictures of the outfits on, I didn't do one for the last one. I'm sorry. It was Christmas and it was just so hectic and I had to hurry up and send all this back so I didn't get to do that. But um, I did add a few photos to it from the times of the items that I kept and tried on before I sent back. But other than that, um, that's it. So thank you so much for watching and I'll be back soon, hopefully with a try on video. See ya. Bye. Bye.